How to hide photos and images in secure folders on your Android phone, Android Central. It's more important than ever to keep your private images private but without deleting them entirely from your phone. With Android, there are a few different ways to hide your photos and images. Even if you don't have the benefit of Samsung's secure folder. Unlike other smartphones that feature additional features like a secure folder, stock Android requires you to do a bit more work to hide images and files. You'll need to create a new folder with a specific name and then move the necessary files and images over to that folder. This creates a new folder on your device that will now be used to move images, pictures, and other files in order to hide them. Now that the folder has been created, you can navigate through the Files app to find the images and move them into the newly created folder. Open the folder that your pictures are stored. This is usually under camera for pictures that you took. Press and hold on the image that you wish to move. And tap on other images you wish to move after the first is selected. Once the images have been moved, they will be hidden from gallery apps. With the exception of Google Photos. But if another gallery viewing app is downloaded after the fact, then the images will be hidden. You can move them back or open the No Media folder to view them later. In the event that you want to hide photos and images in the Google Photos app, here's what you'll need to do. The catch here is that your images and pictures have just been moved to the archive folder. Meaning that if someone were going through all of your folders, then they could potentially still find what you were trying to hide. However, moving them to the archive will remove the photos from the main feed of images in the Photos app. Samsung is known for packing a bunch of features into its devices. Some that are practically useless, but there are some that can come in handy. One such handy feature is the ability to create a secure folder which can be hidden or password protected. Configure your secure folder, including security type, auto lock, and whether you want to show the folder or not. Once completed and set up, you can then access those files from the secure folder directly. It will be placed in your app drawer where a few different apps will be shown with a lock in the bottom right-hand corner. This will make it easier to access files saved to the secure folder. Instead of just showing everything in the folder is a list once it's been unlocked. The secure folder itself also has two shortcuts at the bottom if you want to add apps or add files to the folder. Every week, the Android Central podcast brings you the latest tech news, analysis and hot takes, with familiar co-hosts and special guests. Following Apple removing Fortnite from its App Store, and the subsequent announcement of an Epic Games lawsuit against the company, Google seems to have done the same. There's a lot to look forward to with Android 11. But when will your phone actually get it? Here's everything we know. Are you ready to have some fun with your new Samsung Galaxy phone and get some serious gaming done? Before you can, you'll likely want to get an awesome controller to pair up and make the most out of the experience. No spam. We promise. You can unsubscribe at any time and we'll never share your details without your permission. Text source, androidcentral.com.